This has got to be one of the most intense places I've ever been in my life. You know, when I walked in the hotel, it was like an energy field like kind of hit me when I came to the door. The EMF reading was going off the charts. Wow. I think they know we're here doing this, and I don't know what they think of it. Since we have no way at this point in time to prove a haunting, we have to go the other way. We have to cancel out all the other possibilities. It may not be the hotel. It may be the mountain that it's built on. Basically, it sounds like this mountain is alive, so to speak, and it's, it's part of a recording mechanism. And this may contribute to why so many visitors to the Stanley Hotel actually have uh, a paranormal experience. Do we have anybody walking out there? No. Did you hear that? I heard a knock. Yes. I demand you tell me your name. What was that flash? What was that? When we were investigating down here, one of the guys actually got physically ill. I'm feeling sick. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm feeling I'm sick. Okay, we need dizzy. to go. I'm getting get out. I feel as if mosquitoes or something are biting my back. Lights, so yeah, I can see it right here. It even looks like almost five fingers. Holy cow. Whatever it is, it just came through you. This particular entity is not going to tell us the truth. It's a deceiver. Did you hear that? Mm-hmm. There's a voice in the back. They're not gone. They are not gone. What happened? What's wrong? What happened? What's, what's wrong? What's wrong? The phenomenon that we're experiencing on this trip is, is real.